Hi everyone, it's Kale from Vesa here to introduce you to Access AI, bringing the power of generative AI to bear on the challenge of managing access across the enterprise. First, a little history. Two years ago, we released our access graph and brought an unprecedented level of visibility into who has access to what across all of your cloud infrastructure, on-prem, SaaS, and custom apps. The access graph lets you look at any resource, say, a bucket in S3, and understand all the different identities, whether federated or local, human or non-human, that have access to it, as well as what kind of access, create, read, update, delete, and how they get that access. Now, with the addition of natural language search, we're democratizing the power of the access graph so that even someone who isn't familiar with how all of this access metadata is structured can just ask questions in plain English. So for example, if I want to understand more about privileged accounts who can circumvent multi-factor authentication, I can ask a question like, show me all Okta users without MFA enabled who can delete S3 buckets. Here I can see my 12 Okta users. If I dig into any one, I can confirm that they don't have MFA enabled, and I can verify exactly which buckets they're able to delete. Or let's say I want to understand which roles in AWS are being used by non-human identities. I could ask, show me all the AWS IAM roles that are connected to AWS service principles. And I can see 148 roles that are being utilized by 62 service principles. I can also get access to this information as a list of each service principle to IAM role relationship and export this list to work on it externally. I can even get full insight into the access of any particular user. Let's say I get an alert from CrowdStrike that one of my users might be at risk. I can ask, show me all the access possessed by Okta user Gary Ward. And I see all of Gary's access across my IDPs, cloud infrastructure, SaaS apps, shared folders, data lakes, and storage buckets. Now, as well as making it simple to investigate who has access to what, Access AI can also help you follow best practices in your provisioning. So let's say one of my users, Amber, puts in a request for read access to the customer table in Snowflake. Now I might have hundreds of local roles to choose from, and without visibility into exactly what access they give, it's hard to figure out how to give Amber what she needs without also giving her a load of access that she doesn't need. So I can ask Vesa to recommend a least privileged role. And we can see here that if I give her the marketing role, I'll give her access to a total of eight resources in Snowflake, three of which she has already, giving her a net change of five. Since this is the lowest net change, uh, I can be confident that it's a good choice for least privileged access. To get even smarter here, I can filter this with other VESA queries. For example, I can look at roles that have active users already, or I can exclude roles with access to tables that are especially sensitive. So this is only the beginning of what we can do with Access AI. Look out for more updates in the future as we take the Access Graph's unprecedented visibility into access data and apply the power of generative AI to help you reduce risk, ace your compliance, and give your teams the access they need when they need it. That's all for now. Thanks for watching.